The Sun is believed to have formed around 4.6 billion years ago from a massive cloud of gas and dust called a solar nebula. This cloud was composed mostly of hydrogen and helium, along with small amounts of other elements. As the solar nebula began to collapse under its own gravity, it started to spin faster and faster, flattening into a disk shape. The center of the disk became the protocen, a dense ball of gas that was hot enough to ignite nuclear fusion reactions. As the protocen continued to grow and evolve, it released huge amounts of energy in the form of radiation and solar wind. Over time, this energy cleared away the remaining gas and dust in the solar nebula, leaving behind the planets and other objects that orbit the sun today. The sun's energy comes from nuclear fusion, a process that occurs when hydrogen atoms combine to form helium. This process releases a tremendous amount of energy in the form of light and heat, which is what makes the sun shine. The Parker Solar Probe was designed and built by NASA in collaboration with various partners, including the Johns Hopkins University Applied Physics Laboratory. The mission was named after astrophysicist Eugene Parker, who first proposed the existence of solar winds in the 1950s. The concept for the Parker Solar Probe mission dates back to the 1980s, but it was not until 2010 that NASA officially approved the project. The spacecraft was built over the course of several years, with various components and instruments designed and tested by different teams of scientists and engineers. The Parker Solar Probe was launched on August 12, 2018, aboard a Delta IV heavy rocket from the Cape Canaveral Air Force Station in Florida. The spacecraft is designed to study the sun's corona, the outermost layer of the sun's atmosphere, in unprecedented detail. By flying closer to the sun than any other spacecraft, the Parker Solar Probe is helping scientists to better understand the physics of the sun and its impact on space weather. In terms of its physical construction, the Parker Solar Probe has a unique design that allows it to withstand the intense heat and radiation of the solar corona. The spacecraft is equipped with a carbon composite heat shield that is designed to protect the instruments and other components from temperatures that can reach up to 1,377 degrees Celsius, 2,500 degrees Fahrenheit. The spacecraft also has a range of scientific instruments, including a suite of sensors and cameras that are used to gather data and images of the sun. The Parker Solar Probe, the spacecraft that touched the sun, is designed to withstand the extreme temperatures of the sun's corona. The corona is the outermost layer of the sun's atmosphere, and its temperature can reach up to a million degrees Celsius, 1.8 million degrees Fahrenheit, which is much hotter than the sun's surface. The spacecraft is equipped with a specially designed heat shield that protects it from the sun's intense heat. The heat shield is made of a carbon composite material that is only 4.5 inches thick. It is coated with a white ceramic paint that reflects the sun's heat away from the spacecraft. When the Parker Solar Probe approaches the sun, the heat shield faces the star, absorbing the intense heat and protecting the instruments and other components on board. The heat shield is also equipped with a cooling system that uses water to absorb and dissipate the heat, keeping the spacecraft at a safe temperature. The purpose of the Parker Solar Probe mission is to study the sun's corona, the outermost layer of the sun's atmosphere, in unprecedented detail. The corona is much hotter than the sun's surface, with temperatures that can reach up to a million degrees Celsius, 1.8 million degrees Fahrenheit. This extreme heat causes the corona to expand outward into space, creating a stream of charged particles called the solar wind that can affect our planet's environment and technology. The Parker Solar Probe is designed to fly closer to the sun than any other spacecraft in history, approaching within 4 million miles, 6.4 million kilometers, of the solar surface. 
This close proximity allows the spacecraft to make detailed measurements of the corona and the solar wind, helping scientists to better understand the processes that drive these phenomena. Specifically, the Parker Solar Probe is designed to address three key science objectives. Trace the flow of energy that heats and accelerates the solar corona and solar wind. Determine the structure and dynamics of the magnetic fields in the sun's atmosphere. Investigate the mechanisms that accelerate and transport energetic particles in the solar wind. By achieving these science objectives, the Parker Solar Probe is helping scientists to better understand the fundamental processes that drive the sun's activity and its effects on our planet. This knowledge will be invaluable in predicting and mitigating the impacts of space weather on our technology and infrastructure. The Parker Solar Probe is an innovative and remarkable spacecraft that has made history by becoming the first spacecraft to touch the sun equipped with a specially designed heat shield and advanced scientific instruments. The Parker Solar Probe is studying the sun's corona in unprecedented detail, helping scientists to better understand the processes that drive the sun's activity and its impact on our planet. Through its mission, the Parker Solar Probe is shedding new light on the mysteries of the sun and the solar wind, which have a profound impact on our planet and our technology. The spacecraft's success is a testament to the remarkable engineering and scientific ingenuity that went into its design, and its findings will have far-reaching implications for our understanding of the universe and our place in it.